hey you guys welcome to my channel in today's video i'm going to do a makeup review okay on the urban decay face bond foundation in color 31 yeah i know i know but let's get to the video ah! so yeah um i got the color in 31 it looks like this yeah but i'm gonna try to work with it i'm gonna have to use a lot of concealer but we're gonna make it work but yeah this is 31 medium deep warm golden i should have got like 27 or 28 but yeah i was in a hurry to like pick out a shade because i got this from an influencer and it's popping on tiktok right now and since i already have it like why not because i was not gonna do a i was not gonna do a review on it but i was like you know what i feel like doing makeup why not just go ahead and do a review on this anyway let's get to the video first of all i'm gonna use my urban decay all nighter spray as a setting spray I mean, it is a setting spray, but as a primer because I don't have primer yet. So I'm gonna go ahead now and just use my Hourglass Concealer. This is in color 7.5 Dune. And it's been a while since I did underpainting, but this is gonna have to work because ciao. <laughs> it's a little dark. I'm gonna use my um, Benefits, precisely my brow wax, Benefits Cosmetics. And while this is sitting, I'm gonna go ahead now and just do some of my brows a little bit. Let's shake it up, baby. Shake it up, baby. Okay. All right. Why well, keep trying to twist this? You don't twist this. You just pop it up. So I'm going to bring y'all closer. Okay, you see me. You see me. I see you. You see me. You see me. <laughs> see it now like it doesn't look that bad but in real life <laughs> it looks really really red like I overdid it like it looks like I put a color corrector on here and then mix in it looks really really red but I think I oh this is super spreadable this is the Urban Decay Face Bond Waterproof Foundation. It has a self-setting foundation, which is water, sweat, and humidity proof, smudge and transfer resistant, and no powder needed. Can you believe that? No powder needed. It also has 3% niacinamide, a formula clinically tested to improve skin texture feel after four weeks. It also has a can't feel coverage, which is a lightweight, medium buildable coverage, and it's non-acomogenic, which means it doesn't clog your pores, okay? And they have a variety of shades. It's not a huge variety of shades, but yeah, this is freaking amazing. The only thing is I wish this was a different shade because look at my chest and look at my face. <laughs> do you see it Chad dang I like this and the fact that it's like matte because it says that I don't need powder so now I'm gonna just blend that in good Ooh. okay Look how everything just came together. Wow. <laughs> oh my goodness. This turned out just great. Oh my goodness. And look at the coverage. It says medium coverage. Child, yeah. And it feels like it don't need powder. That's another crazy thing about this. Like, it feels like it doesn't need powder. So, I could have just put this on first and then just added concealer because I thought I had to underpaint to get this the way that I wanted to get it. But looks like I didn't. Oh, my goodness. Now, I definitely need to put some powder under my eyes. <laughs> like, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness.
do I even want to continue? Like, this looks so good. And this turned out good. I still need a lighter shade, though. Look at that. Ah! I'm going to go ahead and use a little bit of my Huda Beauty. This is in Peach Pie. This is the Easy Bake. <laughs> no. Sorry. I do that sometimes. Y'all know what I'm talking about. You know, you just doing your makeup chilling and you think of something that you had watched or something that you said or something that was said and then you just remembered it and then all of a sudden you start laughing. Don't play with me. Y'all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh my God. Okay, so now I'm going to put just a little bit of this color right here. Yes, I'm going to use something lighter for a change. Yeah. I really didn't need a whole lot of powder, you know, to put all over here. I ain't need to do that. I hate that I'm running out of this mascara, though. It brought me, look at, <sighs> but look how it look on top of this. Look at this. Look at that. This ain't, I ain't put no highlight on. You saw me. I think I'm going to put on this light pink right here. I think I am. Let me see how this is going to react, though. freaking adore it ah! so i'm gonna use my in beauty glaze lip oil and this in is in cinnamon bun and i want this to be glossy but let me make sure i get this thing you know what i'm saying a little super moisturizing on my lips and it's not sticky and i like for this to be glossy this is cute or whatever but i'm gonna add some gloss but before i do that let me go ahead and my setting spray let's see how this reacts with setting spray oh my gosh let's see Cause it says it doesn't need powder. Let's see. And it don't. Now I'm gonna go ahead and put on my clear gloss by Avon. And I'm almost out and that sucks. It gives me the gloss I desire that I want. And I want a little bit of color, a little pale to it. So I'm gonna add the LA Colors uh, lipstick and Old Teddy. Yeah, more of a bubblicious color. Thank y'all so much for watching this video. This is the end of this makeup video. I appreciate y'all for watching, but I give this a 10 out of 10. I highly recommend. I will link it down in the description box below, okay? This is pretty freaking good for it to have all of that sweat proof, waterproof, transfer proof, no powder needed. Until y'all see me in the next video, and you will. You will, child. Bye.